Hello, my name is Elizabeth A. I'm safe and sorry. I'm Rita Maiman. And I'm Rita Shaw. And today we are going to be presenting to you the effects of air pollution on the body. So you're probably wondering why we didn't go with the obvious route and talk about COVID-19 or the effects of AC. This is because we believe that there must be change in both within our environment due to various mass health related diseases caused by air pollution. Air pollution has been around far too long and has affected way too many people. For the audience that does not know, air pollution is the existence of harmful or poisonous substances in the air. Our goal is to spread awareness regarding both lung and heart health and how the effects of air pollution is a very prominent leading cause behind many of these life-altering diseases such as arrhythmia, emphysema, lung cancer, chronic bronchitis, and many more. In the state of Texas, air pollution is an ongoing threat to our health and as a group we want to educate our fellow high school peers in understanding that the air we breathe in our overall environment has a large impact upon our health. We hope that sharing more information about air pollution and its side effects will act as a catalyst to improving air conditions over time. During this past month of February, the state of Texas experienced a catastrophic snowstorm that impacted many Texans' lives. Air pollution is one problem that is consistently being ignored. Many Texans use household items such as outdoor grills, generators, fireplaces, and other carbon dioxide emit emitters to help keep warm. However, these household items release carbon dioxide at an extreme scale, which can lead to more carbon emissions in the air and unfortunately lead to carbon monoxide poisoning. So, to inform our fellow high school students on these substantial matters, we displayed a PowerPoint describing health effects of air pollution and how we can improve condition and also reduce pollutants within the air as well. After presenting the PowerPoint, we played a quick game of Jeopardy, which is comprehensive to our PowerPoint. We wanted to educate and inform our peers the air quality within our environment and showcase how detrimental having poor quality is to our health. We hope that our peers take this information and become inspired to make a change within their daily lives or even pursue a career to help our environment and contribute to better air quality. Air pollution is an issue that affects many within our community. However, most individuals do not realize the effects of air pollution can cause diseases or even worsen health conditions. Through our activity of running our presentation, we want to inform high school students about air pollution and how it affects our health. We hope that these career-oriented students can inform others and eventually aid in changing our overall environment and the factors that contribute to such poor air quality. By improving air conditions and reducing air pollution, less fatalities will occur from health-related diseases which are caused by air pollution. For our presentation, we used materials such as a laptop, a projector, a PowerPoint, a Jeopardy, and a Google form for our survey. Before our presentation, we took about five minutes to set up our projector and then took another five minutes to introduce ourselves and our topic to the students before we went over the PowerPoint. It took us about 20 minutes to present the PowerPoint, and then we had a post-presentation activity of a game of Jeopardy, which took the, about 30 minutes to complete. We then gave an evaluation survey about our presentation, and that took him five minutes to complete, and asked them at the end if they had any questions, which also took him five minutes. Rita Shaw had the role of formatting the portfolio. Elizabeth Abe and Rita Maiman had the duty of creating the PowerPoint, including the key details regarding our PowerPoint. I, safe and sorry, created my own version of Jeopardy to keep our audience engaged and active. In order to receive feedback from our presentation, we made every audience member fill out a Google form, which allowed us to see what we can improve on and how well our presentation went over with our respected audience. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to listen to our presentation about the effects of air pollution within the human body.